gonna give it that good 10 second burnout, and I'm gonna get down the track. Let's do it, dude. This is Bobby T, and you're watching Makeshift Garage. How you feeling? Good. Alrighty. <laughs> so I had to wake back up so that the light could get reset. Look at all these tumbleweeds! Get that out of my carburetor! Ah! Oh God, the tumbleweeds are coming! That should get me down a track. Let's do it. Not that many people here, which is fantastic. So you can go down a track a lot of times. So that's good. First time I went down there today, I did not do the burnout. I should have did the burnout. And I spun when I left. And finally she hooked and took off. And I, you know, I still, I did like a 10 8. That's ridiculous. I've already done nines with snow tires on it. And I think this is it for the year for me. I think what I'm gonna do is park the car, rebuild me a really good transmission with a really good 460 big block and come back next year ready to fight. What do you think of that? We'll do it over the winter. Let's get Devin's car going. That's what I want to do. Feeling good. Let's blow this transmission up. I don't think it's got but one run left in it. We're going to find out though.
actually 240. 240, that's why I stalled at the line. Oh, oh my God, if I would've hooked the first time, I'd have been in the eights. Second time around, she just died. It was so hot, I'm looking at it going, oh my God, and then making it wait, 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 and then it just got too hot. By the time I hit it, she wanted to die. Hey, check it out, come here, Devin, let me show you this. He got seven, seven, and his spark plug wire fell off. He could pull one more wire and still beat me. <laughs> Father and son, get off the couch. Build yourself something, take it to the track, blow it up. Have fun, broskies, have fun. Hey, so if you like what you see, man, make sure, subscribe. <laughs> Sounds good. I look at that, oh, I love it. Oh man, we gotta do something like this, see? We got things to look forward to, that's the beauty of this. You don't have a zip tie, do you? Oh, that ain't terrible. It sucked it back in, because there's almost, there's almost nothing in there now. I got bags of these things. Yeah, I don't know why I did Zip that. ties and duct tape. Yeah, and duct tape. <laughs> I got a few of them now. Right, now I'm good. good. So if I gotta cut that, now I can put it back on. Yeah. So they're gonna make me put a real catch can in. I went to tech and they said, look, we're gonna let you slide on three things today, but three things gotta be done next time you come. You need a real loop around the drive shaft. I just got a, flat, a bar that's bolted. It has to actually go around it and then bolt. Catch can has to be a real catch can. So I gotta get that done. They want a kill switch outside on a trunk, in a trunk area so that the guy on the line, if I catch on fire, boom, he could kill the kill switch. Shut me down. out of there. You know what I need to give it is a little seltzer. That's the problem. It didn't, it doesn't need water. It needs seltzer, broskies. Polar, you know it needs some stuff, right? I gave it to it. Oh yeah, she's gonna make time now. Time it off a little, cause she's running awful hot. I'm gonna back it off just a little bit. Let's see. That was good. That was at least two degrees. Check the oil. She should be good. Yep. Perfect. We'll get back online. 
I gotta get a clean run. I can't leave until I get a clean run. That time, I, I, I bumped the light and it went dull. So he said, back up a little. So I backed up a little too far and it tripped it, turned it red. I didn't know that you gotta just back up a hair. Now I know. Blue distributor bolt tripped out. Blue the distributor out. Blew all the blades off the carburetor. Okay. Are you kidding me? And you fixed it right here. Yo, that's the man right there, Don. That's the, it, that is the man. You gotta you bring up the part right here. its best when it comes back home. I think it's just happy to not be beat on. So guess what? We're going to park it now. We're done for the season, man. Next time this car goes down the track, it's going to have new heads, a new roller cam, rock of, rock of rollers, the whole thing. I'm going to do this thing up nice, man. We can't go down there and go slow anymore. Let's put a period to this and get to some other projects. Let's do it, broski. Ready? <laughs> We got a lot of projects to do and we're gonna get to them. Let's get them done, broskies.